All right, thanks again for joining us for another uh, week of Tackle Tip of the Week. This tip is kind of a simple tip, but it has to do with photography. Uh, it doesn't matter if you're walleye fishing, muskie, bass, whatever. I see a lot of bad pictures of really nice fish. And I think people, you tend to rush and don't get a good photo. So what we do, especially when we're muskie fishing, I, uh, we net the fish, if we know we want to take a picture of it, we keep this net and the fish right in the water. So someone will hang on to this and we keep it on the gunnel so the fish is in the net, swimming around, fine. Somebody keeps a hand on this, we get the cameras and everything ready. Get the rods out of the way, get your camera ready, that fish will be fine as long as it's in the water. So then in the last second, when everybody's ready, we'll pick that fish up, try to get a nice photo. If you want a nice background, you don't want to be taking a picture into the sun. Um, it's worth it. You spent the time to catch this beautiful fish. Why not get a great picture of it or a video? So take your time. Um, get the fish in the net. Take your time. Get the boat organized. Get your cameras ready. And then set up for a really nice picture or video, whatever it may be. Alright, thanks again for joining us for another uh, edition of Tackle Tip of the Week. Uh, this tip has to do with crossbows. Uh, archery season is just around the corner. Here we are in the second, uh, second week of September. Archery opens October 1st and crossbow will come in for the last two weeks of archery. Uh, there are several different crossbows on the market. This happens to be a compound crossbow. Um, this is a manual cocking crossbow. Some of them have an auto cock on them or a, a crank type handle where you attach your uh, cocking device and actually crank it back into place. This one you do by hand with a cocking rope. Uh, there are certain uh, requirements in New York State. 200 pound draw is the max. And there's also requirements on the limbs, uh, the distance between the limbs too. So you want to check that out. And one other important thing to note, to carry a crossbow you have to have a muzzle loader uh, permit. So you've got to buy that muzzle loading stand or permit before you hunt with a crossbow. Um, you don't need the bow hunter course, you just need your hunter course and buy the muzzle loader tag. And uh, happy hunting. things to do is take a banana in your lunch. Banana! Uh, don't bring it out until you're ready to eat lunch though. But the captain, they will love you for that. Um, just dispose of the, the peel when you're done. But it's a great tip. Take a banana with you. Uh, you get a lot of eyebrows on that one.